Hey guys, this is Chris from Empire Bricks and welcome to another LEGO haul video. Today we've got three things. Um, there are supposed to be two Bricklink orders and one uh, deal from the local version of eBay. Um, I'm not sure if that's in the box or in the envelopes, but um, let's have a look and find out. So just work our way up from the, from the top or work our way down and open the first envelope. Um, so here it is. And this is definitely a Bricklink order. Um, all right, very tightly packaged. So I'm just gonna open this zip bag to get some stuff out. Um, this is a Boba Fett figure. I'm gonna need that for a, one of my projects. And I was looking for a way to get Boba Fett, but um, most of the sets that he comes in are pretty expensive, so this was the best way to get him. Um, legs to further complete my Storm and Scout Trooper Imperial Army. There are a few um, Storm Trooper bodies. I think these are phase two, if I'm correct, um, and one Scout Trooper body. There are a lot of body parts for droids so some legs for the uh, security droids these are for assassin droids um, the heads are the most difficult to get for most droids so i'm kind of having a lot <laughs> i'm having trouble finding the heads i have a lot of bodies and, and legs and stuff but no heads um, no problem getting heads for the troopers though um, i tend to fill them in with black heads because it's the cheapest way to build the army there are two orange dishes for a secret project and some printed pieces. I can use some advice from you guys. I found these in the Brickling store. These are definitely um, Arabesh um, uh, characters, but I have no idea what this piece is from. And there were quite, quite a few. But they look kind of cool, they're perfect for uh, mock building. Um, so I have, let's see, one, two, three, four, I think I've got eight of them. So that's a cool thing. And some eight by eight black plates. Um, uh, very cool for mock building and stuff and there were a few. I didn't even know these exist, so that's a good thing to have these. Great for mock building. Um, next up is the next envelope. Pretty heavy, by the feel of it. Um, I'm pretty thickly packaged, a lot of tape and stuff. Um, okay, so another large zip bag, and can it open? Ah, yes. Lots of different stuff in this one. Um, there it is. We have some white plates and yellow modified bricks. Uh, these are for one of my secret projects that I'm working on. Um, there are some inverted slopes, uh, same story. I don't know why they're not in a zip bag, but they're in here, that's the most important. I got a few extra of these. Um, I recently did a, a review on the um, first order snow speeder. And there were a few of these included in the set and they're great for, you know, having like stuff lying around in a base or something. So that was a good thing that I could order a few more of those. Then here, oh, well, this is creatively packaged. It's all put together. This is a lot of different stuff. So I'll try to um, loosen it up. There are these uh, support poles also for base and mock building. All these red plates are for one of my secret projects, but here there are these two light bricks and a, this one has an empty battery. This one seems to work. So I'm trying to do some stuff with light um, and I hope this is going to work. So really happy to have these. I think I'll have the battery replaced from this one, but um, there's a screw underneath, as you can see. So it's gonna be a little bit of a project, but um, I'll do my best. Really cool to have these. I, I have 
seen these uh, only recently in a in another set uh, that was the first time that i saw them and there are so much stuff you can do with them here are some uh, gray eight by eight plates and some gray dark bluish gray bricks everything to build some mocks with same here some modified bricks this is a really strange way of packaging and order I'm not really happy with how they did this but um i guess it's complete so not complaining but uh it's just harder to check if everything is there and there's some loose stuff so there's one more of these crate some hinges and um these two one of which should not have the sticker on it i ordered them without sticker so i'll have to remove that kind of sloppy um i'll check the envelope and i'm definitely gonna leave a bad review on this brickling store so this is not how stuff should end up here but i'm still i'm happy to have the pieces though and um, after ordering at least 20 different bricklink orders i think it's allowed to have one that's not completely up to standards uh, this was also loose in it so one um, half or a quarter cylinder glass panel um, also for mock building i'm just trying to collect a lot of stuff that um that I can do different things with because of the Jetta mock. When I'm gonna take that apart, I'll have a lot of uh, tan bricks, but it's kind of limited what you can do with that because you can um, do Tatooine stuff or Jakku stuff, but no bases. And um, I don't have that much dark gray stuff. So it's good to have you know more different sort of bricks so I can creatively build more mocks for you guys. So this is the last box. Um, also completely taped shut, so it's kind of hard to open up. Um, let's see if I can rip it open. Yeah. And yes, oh, this is great. This is how you package something. This is just, it's a box. I didn't ask for it, but it's perfectly sized to get through, uh, through the door. Everything is here in a zip bag. Because this is set 7151, the Sith Infiltrator from 1999 or 2000. But um, one of the very, very first um, Lego Star Wars sets ever made. I'm really happy to have this. If you've watched my previous haul videos, you've seen that I had a, quite a few um, sets with the Sith Speeder and Sith Troopers. I'm trying to build something of a Sith Army. Um, but since I didn't have anything of a larger vehicle and the Fury class interceptor is about a hundred bucks, I thought this was a very cool and pretty cheap way to um, you know, start a Sith army. So this was um, 12 bucks, I think, which is a great deal. It's about 200 pieces. So the piece count is definitely there. Really happy to have this. Um, we'll also be reviewing that soon. I'm not sure when I can do the Sith army because it's pretty small still, um, but uh, yeah, just keep following the channel and you'll see it pop up sometime. So lots of different stuff. One Bricklink order that didn't um, really cut it for me, but um, yeah, I I'm going to have to go through this and take it apart because uh, I'll have to check that everything is there, but it I think it is. And you're going to see what I'm going to do with all these uh, all these things. So stay tuned and see you at the next video.